Hey, most of us are welcome back to another Pokemon Master video, and uh, I am, uh, first of all, I'm very, very happy right now because of the uh, polls that we just had. As you could probably tell from uh, the amount of copies, <laughs> the, the, the sync move level of this Arc Suit Lan Lance and Dragonite that you're staring at right now. Um, yeah. Anyways, uh, that aside, more excited to actually check out the, uh, the unit. Although, let's not go into the 5 of 5. Um, Real quick, first let's let's try out try out three out of five, just see how it is before Relentless, and then we could kind of we kind of compare it afterwards, right? With Relentless and the extra the rebuff, right? They got five out of five. So, anyways, um, yeah, this is what we're gonna run. We're gonna have Lucas Dialga set Dragon Zone, and then uh, Champion B to give both a uh, physical and special move up next, because he has both physical and special moves, right? And then we could throw it up against Latios just to see how it goes, right? Because I think it's theoretically it should be nice, right? You know, you got the um, the both defense, special defense debuffs, and then your moves always hit, and I think it should be fine. All right, let's let's go uh, ahead and jump right into this. Okay, so again, Lance just a insane defense debuffer, right? And uh, supposedly the sync should be good too. Although we're not running um, mainly based on the sync. First, right? Um, this first first round, uh, we could do that when we get the five or five EX roll in, All right? Let's just um, let's just chill a bit right now and just just do the three out of five part. Okay. All right. Get that in. Um, I suppose we could Dragon Wish right now. Let's get Gig Impact there as uh, in there as well. And then we should have our uh, max multiplier for our sync. <laughs> and the max, you know, physical defense debuff as well, since the sync is physical, right? So, boom. Amazing. And there we go. Let's get the sync in. There's that. And uh, we probably get another one in there, right? Then we have our B move up as well. Which should theoretically be pretty good as well. Also, um, the CX half it looks really, really good. By the way, it's just that I like his regular one better, so I'm probably gonna switch back afterwards. All right, you know that was pretty nice. That was pretty nice. Again, um, we don't have Tech EX yet because he's not technically Tech EX, <laughs> right? So there's that. Anyways. Let's, uh, let's get the B-move in. Let's try out the B-move. Like, theoretically, this should be a very, very powerful B-move, right? Super high power. Like, this, that's more base power than, like, a lot of, like, <laughs> sync moves, right? Do keep in mind, we are not super effective here. And it doesn't matter. <laughs> and it doesn't matter. And it doesn't even matter at all. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Okay, okay. Um, oh, we have to... <laughs> I didn't notice the the dragon zones go down. I have to re reset that. Yeah, like, man, and 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 like the great, the really really nice part that I like about it is, is because you have that both physical and special. So in uh, stages where you know there isn't like a really really big damage reduction either way, you can just swap between those, right? And uh, outside of the, <laughs> outside of the debuffs that you get, right? Uh, especially if you're running. Is support like champion bead like the extra like you can make use of both physical and special move up next right and then he also has you know plus two on on his um on his sync as well in, in the grid that we picked up right at or after sync which uh, i'm pretty sure was like after every single sync not just for the first sync only right yep after every single sync so after every single sync right get two turns of just boosted versions of these uh these moves so it's just man it's it's so nice it is so nice this unit it's just so convenient <laughs> right you just got like everything going for you wow 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 and again there's just a lot of really really good dragon types yeah. uh, although again there's not like that many dragon zone setters but you don't it doesn't matter it doesn't matter <laughs> It doesn't really matter. Like, is Dragon Zone nice? Yeah, sure, but do you really need it in most case scenarios for this guy to just absolutely obliterate the opponent? No, not at all. Not at all. All right, let's uh, let's let's go ahead and tech roll KKM real quick. Which, by the way, 
um, Power Rituals actually updated that his B move over here, it increases by 20%, right, with every single, um, you know, uh, 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 decrease over here, right, the, yeah, and so that tops out at, what, 3.4 times the max amount of damage, which I'm pretty sure is higher than Ash and Pikachu's, right? Let me check his, um, um, his, his B move. Yeah, it's actually, it's, it's actually higher. It's actually higher than, um, than, than, than Ash's, uh, buddy Thunderbolt, right? Because that one's, what, 2 point, it, up to, like, 2.5 times the base power, and then, um, Lance's, what, up to 3.4 times, right? And then, you know, if you also want to count the innate, like, defense debuffs in there as well, like, wow. We got it, man. We, we got someone who has a move that hits harder than, than Ash, Ash and Pikachu. <laughs> but anyways, let's, uh, let's, let's try him out over here at, uh, 5 out of 5. We also have the, um, the extra 5 out of 5 nodes, um, that I, very fortunately, have uh, accrued so let's um hmm because they're definitely gonna go into the second bar <laughs> before we get to do uh anything serious here let's see yeah we could do that yeah and then uh, again we, we come in with the uh the dragon rebuff up down let's let's just not attack with the alga the alga could chill for now uh, even though, you know, one of the big things about this unit is, uh, makes all the other units on the, well, all the other, well, I mean, I guess, tech, yeah, all the other units on the team hit harder, <laughs> right? Regardless if you're Dragon or not, just because, you know, the, um, the physical and special debuffs, right, just end of itself. Okay, here we go. We get a sink in here, and this is, uh, most likely gonna finish the rest of this, uh, this gauge. And then we could we could try our B move out there as well. And uh, there we go, the beautiful, beautiful. Which which by oh speaking of by the way, this Dragonite sync move. Oh my God, that doubled. That more more than doubled, right? Jesus. Oh, and it already hit so hard, man. This is this is uh. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I probably could have gotten an extra um, power up in there before. Wow. Wow. 53,000, right? With the uh, with the extra, you know, um, the extra, like, defense or, or, like, damage reduction that Latios has, right? And not super effective either. Wow. No. Nah. We got to see it. We got to see it without the... um. We just got to make it survive a bit so we could use it on the first gauge just because I'm, I'm, I'm curious with the uh, with the B move, how much it could do. All right. Just in the first post sync. Let's see. Well, let's finish this one first. Obviously. Um, wait, did I not gig impact? Oops, I forgot to gig impact. That's that's my bad. That's my bad. It's fine. It's fine. It will uh, probably not survive here either. <laughs> Spoiler alert. Regardless. Oh, we didn't even crit there. <laughs> we didn't even crit there. That's like 30 something K. Um, so that. And, and, and we flinch. Well, he has an unflappable in the grid, so. <laughs> if you're really worried about that, that's, that's not a problem either. That's not a problem either. If you really want to avoid that happening. Okay, speed this up a bit. And, uh, voila. There we go. Uh, amazing. We have 41k on a, you know, regular move, not, not super effective. That's, that's, that's cool. That's cool. That's, that's very nice. Okay. Or, or, or we could try it out. We could try it out on, on, on Latios, because he's pretty sure he has more, um, HP parts that are Dragon Week, right? You know, just in case. Uh, speaking of just in case, let's just, let's just not buff his, like, stats yet. <laughs> let's just use, um, let's just, let's just use these two moves just to, you know, yeah. Oh, 
Comes in with that went with the extra special special defense, right? Okay. That's fine. We could spend an extra turn doing that. Before Oh my god, bro! <laughs> we didn't even buff our stats yet, man. <laughs> Are you kidding? Please. <laughs> Please, man. Alright, well, I mean, this look, this 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 HP bar is not so I mean, regardless. Let's just let's just go ahead and let's go ahead and sink. <laughs> well, I'll just go ahead and sink then. It's fine. He has he has another bar that's uh, that's dragon weak. And boom. <laughs> I know it's Latios, but <laughs> come on, man. Come on. Anyways, uh, we can actually get, get an extra one in there. Just for fun. Alright. Latios, man. This is... <laughs> nuclear bomb versus, um, coughing baby. Or hydrogen bomb. I suppose it's supposed to be. <gasps> oh my god. This has to be. This has to be. Wow. 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 Ash, you're still really good, but there's a new <laughs> highest, you know, single move damage dealer in the game, I guess. <laughs> oh my goodness. Not that, it, again, it doesn't really matter um, in the grand scheme of things, but it's, it's just, just kind of funny. It's just kind of funny. It's just kind of funny, is all. That's with none of the multipliers, by the way, because we didn't hit them. Didn't get the debuffs in. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Dude. That's hilarious. That is hilarious. That's ho this is a hilarious. All three of these arc suit units are hilarious. Again, whichever one you pull, right? Whichever one you pull, just go for your favorite one, all right? Or, or which, which type slash role you have like a more need at. Whichever one you get is, is unbelievably good, all right? <laughs> all right, as usual, let's uh, let's check out his sync pair story again before we're done. <laughs> That is, that is so Lance, bro. Just chilling here with three Dragonites, because that's 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 how he rolls. Plus, pilot Lance accompanied by three Dragonite. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yep, that's that Lance. Oh, Paul's fa fancy meeting you here. <laughs> Amazing, right? Does that surprise you? Um, all three of these Dragonite are my Pokemon. Uh, just now, I was having all of them train together. Hey. Uh, while you're here, how about I give you a little quiz? Among these Dragonite, uh, among these Dragonite is my partner Pokemon, the one I was partnered with when I was awakened with my Arc Suit. Are we supposed to guess which one? Which one is it? They all look the same. I'm sorry. Mm. Wait. Um, Dragonite doesn't have gender differences, right? I mean, if they do, I'm not seeing any, unless it's like a slight length of its, like, horn or antennas. I don't know. Uh, let's just go with... Let's go with middle, just because, like, middle... Amazing. Wow, color me impressed. That's okay. just this one. <laughs> I thought he was about to bring in a fourth one. <laughs> I thought Buddy was about to bring in a fourth one. <laughs> Uh, other trainers may not see a huge difference, yes. but I could clearly see what sets each one apart from the others. They all worked hard to excel in different areas. It's true that dragons are tr tricky to raise. Um, very true. It involves at what, level 51 or something? 55? Not a brag, but I went through a lot to raise them into the strong, reliable Pokemon they are now. Yes. I trained the three of them together and kept challenging really tough trainers over and over again. Hmm. When there was still a Dratini and Dragonair, we lost a sh fair share of those battles. Um, I also battled red and blue with two Dragonair when we first met. I have different memories of raising each of my Dragonite, good ones and rough ones. We continued to gain experience and grow together, which brought us uh, to where we are now. Because of the way I bonded with these Dragonite I raised, I was able to awaken a new kind of power. 
That said, I don't think this is the best we can do as a sync pair either. Yes. We've gained a new partner with Sark suit, but I can't get complacent. I plan on always aiming higher. It would be the best fe uh, feeling ever to strengthen my bonds with my other Dragonite and battle them uh, in my arc suit. Aw. Hey. The time you spend with your Pokemon will become precious memories that will help you grow as a sync pair. Don't forget to cherish your Pokemon pose. Challenge battle together, you. warrior together, and let your bond grow. When was the last time I used <laughs> Pikachu? <laughs> MC Pikachu. <sighs> ah. That's nice. You know. I think he needs a few more Dragonites. Do you guys think? I think he needs a few more. <laughs> Anyways. That was really this one, I guess. Hope you all enjoyed me, guys. Think of the comments down below. Like to the video for channel for some more poll messages content. I'm almost done with my moving, so hopefully I should be able to upload a bit more um, soon. So that's cool because there's a lot of things I want to do. There's a lot of things I, I want to do in terms of there's a lot of anniversary stuff. Um, and also a lot of other things I need to catch up on. So, <laughs> all right, have fun. Um, good luck guys are pulling a uh, happy anniversary and uh, I'll see you guys in the next one.